Hello! Today we're going to cover how to import content from one eClass course into another. To start, when you're inside of the course you wish to import into, you'll go to the top right and click the little gear icon and select Import. If you have less than 10 courses, you'll see your course listed here that you want to import from. However, if you have more, You'll need to click into the search box and enter the course name. Select your course and click Continue. Here, you'll choose the top level of items that you want to import. For this example, we'll be importing everything as we're going from a blank course and we're importing content from a template. However, if you're only looking to import specific items, you'll likely only want to include activities and resources and uncheck everything else. Keep in mind, though, that if you're importing a quiz as well, you want to make sure to include the question bank. At this point, you'll be shown a list of every single item within the course that you're importing from. As this is a template course, it has a lot of things that we don't need, so we can pick and choose what it is that we want to include. If you only have a small amount, you'll likely want to click Select None to deselect everything in the course. However, as we want to pick most of the items, we'll select all. I know that in this course, I want to include the important course information topic, the Start Here topic, and the Graded Activities and Assessments topic. But I know that this course doesn't have any discussion items, so we can go ahead and remove all of those. Additionally, I know that this course doesn't have a pre-class topic, so we can just go ahead and deselect that entirely. It does need a course content topic, and we don't want any of these module topics. Deselecting the top level will gray out all of the items, and they will not be included. So, you don't need to worry about deselecting each one of them individually. When you've reached the end of the page, click Next. Here, you'll see a list just for your review of everything. So, as I said, we're going to include all of the top level import settings. But if we were only importing specific items, we would only include activities and resources, and possibly question bank if we're including quizzes. Here, we'll see a list of all of the items we're including, with X's next to any of the items we're not including. When you're content that this is accurate, scroll all the way to the bottom and click Perform Import. At this point, eClass will now import all of the content from the import course into your original course. This can take a few moments, depending on how large of an import you're doing. If there's anything unusual about the course, you'll see a warning here. I'm not concerned about this, and I'm happy with everything else. I'm going to hit continue. And now I can see all the items that have been put into my course. One important note, eClass will match each topic from the import course into the course you're importing into. So, Everything that was in Topic 1 has gone into here, Topic 2 has gone into here, 3, and we'll see that this topic doesn't have anything in it. This is because I did not include the pre-class topic from the Import Work course. So, this will need to be deleted, as well as any extra topics down at the end. Thank you very much!